Hello everyone, welcome back to Empyreon Galactic Survival Reforged Eden version 1.9. In the last episode we ran a couple of POIs and we got the goodies from them. Um, nothing really spectacular for the burial chamber and whatnot. But I figured what we would do today in today's episode, we would go to a new galaxy like Delta or something like that. One of the other galaxies and see if we can't find an abandoned mine. Because I want to show you how to beat the abandoned mine. It's pretty simple. Either either the abandoned mine or the abandoned factory is what we're going to be looking for. We have plenty of resources on the ship to make ammunition and whatnot. So without further ado. We are in... Alpha. We worked over to Delta. I think we go to Epsilon. Yeah, let's go to Epsilon. See what kind of planets are there. As soon as I figure out where the marker is here. It's over that way. Alright, let's go. What we're doing is we're allowing the auto miners to um, collect ore while we're out and about. Look at that red sun. Alright, what do we got here? We got Purgatory. Say we head over to Epsilon 2. And warp. I put us way out here. Taxi dash, right? Silicon asteroid, iron asteroid. Nothing really to write home about right this second. If we don't find anything on this planet, then we'll warp over to um, Epsilon 3. I'm holding my fingers crossed here that we find the abandoned mine or the abandoned factory. If we find the abandoned drone base, I'll do that one too because that usually has um, three epic containers in it. Excuse me. I got the burps today. I'm feeling much better today than I have in a little while. I got plenty of sleep. Get up. I have my first cup of coffee here, or my second cup of coffee here. Just waking up. I've been awake for probably about an hour now. Just enjoying some coffee, was watching some YouTube. Alright. Abandoned factory. Oh, no, that's the abandoned reactor. Have we been here before? We have. Alright. I mean... Hmm. It didn't show a warp line. Um, I guess we've been here before. Alright, hold on. We've been to Delta too. The rogue system maybe. Cause one there was beta too. Delta. Let me go this way here real quick. Beta. Beta right here. 
There we go. Let's lock that target. I know I haven't been there because there's no warp lines. Alright. This is what happens when you warp around too much. Hmm. <laughs> That's some good coffee. All right. Ooh, we got a lot of things. Go to beta three. Feeling lucky. Warp number one. Cruise control on. The tax dash right there. Told you. You can tell by the spirals uh, sticking out of it. We don't need any pentaxid right to the second. We got four th or one thousand something in the tank. How much do we have in the tank? I made up some steel blocks, by the way. 1,101. Come on. Get to beta 3. Who knew flying would take so long? Alright, so we're looking for POIs we haven't rated before. It's very bright. Is this going to be another dead planet? Polaris Habitat. Alright, this planet is big. That means there's not going to be... We'll go over here a little bit. We'll start heading west. What's this planet computer? Desert. Okay. There's not going to be POIs on this planet. Just saying. We'll find like, um, we'll fly a little bit around. But we're just going to find just Polaris and Xerax. I don't think we're going to find, um, yeah, this planet has Neo on it. That's a pirate to hide out. figure out what this is and then we'll bounce over to another sector because I don't think there's going to be any purple POIs on this and that's what we're looking for yeah well, let's bounce to the next planet here planet hopping <laughs> alright What's UI? What's it have on it? Yeah, let's go over to UI.
Take a drink of my coffee while we're warping here. So what do you guys think of Imperion? Is it a cool game? Have you played it before? Are you enjoying it? Are you trying Reforged Eden out and whatnot? I mean, the scenarios that come out on the workshop are just amazing. There's another one that I'm keeping my eye out that I want to do a series on, which is um, by Old Time Gamer. As soon as he updates his scenario, I really want to try... Um, what you call it? I can't remember the name of the scenario. I think it's like Escape from Purgatory or something. But I want the Reefer Forge version of it, and then we're gonna mat. We're gonna crank up the settings and see what happens. There's a lot of ships flying around in this place. We don't want to find out what that heat signature, the red one, is. Could be a destroyer class. We'll, uh, we'll venture forth in the, um, to this planet, and hopefully we'll find some good POIs to raid. I could use some more steel plate to make more, um, steel blocks. Because I have, what, what do I have? I have 4,000 blocks for the base right now. And landfall. Oh, purple signatures. That's always good. I can't read what that says. Does it say vessel yard? Another vessel yard. All right. Mm, I don't see any other purple around me right this second. How big is this planet? Oh, it's a little bitty planet. We can skirt around it real quick. Yeah, that's an. At least I think I said vessel yard. Assembly yard. We haven't done one of those in this series. We'll come back to that. Let's see what else is here. Because that is a long POI. That's like, you know, you park there and then basically you run the POI. And I mean, it's a pretty, pretty hard POI to run. Because there's so many nightmares in there. It's kind of like the bunker. Yeah, I think um, in the next episode what we'll do is we'll do the assembly yard. Because we need a full episode in order to um, do it. I mean, granted we're only 14 minutes into this video, but I don't think I could speed run the... Um, the abandoned assembly yard. Why is there X present on this planet? Fly up above them. Make sure they can't see me. <laughs> or shoot at me anyways. There's the weapon bunker. It's always a good POI to run. It's got a lot of loot barrels in it. There's a back doorway in order to get into that one. I'll have to show you guys that when we bring in an attack ship. 
Uh, it's becoming dark time. Let's head this way back into the light. signature what are you purple signature it's not telling me no I'm still not close enough yet let me sit down and make a daylight Abandoned archaeologist dig site. Junkie POI. I don't even know why that POI is even in the game. It's got like two loot barrels. And like maybe like 10 or 20 nightmares. That's about it. If that. By far the worst POI you could find. I'm trying to head into the daylight. Here, let me sit down and make a daylight and then we'll continue with searching. Let's park on top of this mountain here. That sounds like a good place to, um. Turn the thrusters off. Whoops, not turns. Make a daylight for everyone. Right. Yeah, the abandoned assembly yard is in the next episode, everyone. So look forward to that. We're going to just mark out this area here. Yeah, the new drivers for my graphics card updated and Icarus run is running much better now. Um, I am going to bring another playlist to the, to the, to the plate. It's called Hold Your Own. I guess, um, it was abandoned way back when and then a new developer recently picked it up within the last year or so. I bought it for like 10 bucks and I was debating on doing a series on it on my YouTube channel. So what I'm going to do is since I only have two videos during the weekend which is Satisfactory and Icarus, I'm going to give it a spot on the weekend. So expect um, to see Hold Your Own come out. Because what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to breathe new content into my channel so that I can get my channel to grow. I do appreciate each and every one of you that have stuck around through the good times and the bad times and my ups and downs in the YouTube channel. And yeah, you know, without you guys I wouldn't make content. What is that? Small package. Ooh, a lot of players over here. I wonder if we'll find Sanctuary. Only time will tell. Is that Sanctuary? That is Sanctuary. Map. 
I wonder why it doesn't show up on the map. Let's go check this out real quick. You done firing on things, ship? You good? Wait a little bit here. All right. This is sanctuary. I wonder how much, um, Guns are going for these days. Solar cells. Oh, man. I need, like, a lot of those. So, Sanctuary has solar cells. He has crew members. <coughs> he has advanced multi-tools that he'll take. Night vision goggles. Multi-tools and night vision goggle. I know I have some night vision goggles somewhere. There's some night vision goggles. I'm here to buy. Actually, I'm here to sell, basically. Don't like how it takes the one from my hot bar, but that's okay. And... So we're up to 10 grand. I mean, he's taking boost. All of them. So we have radiation boost. Not that. We're going to keep the multi boost. All right. How may I serve you? I'm here to sell you some boost. Jetpack boost. Mobility boost. Multi boost. Insulation boost. Oxygen boost. Radiation boost. We're at 37. Mm, this guy is selling pistol rounds. Okay, what else does this guy take in here? He's taking medium reinforced armor. Medium reinforced armor. We do have a couple pairs of that. Sorry about that. I had to sneeze. All right. That gave us a pretty penny. Can we buy any solar cells? I'm here to buy, buddy. Solar cells. He has 14 of them. And we're broke. Does this guy sell bridges? That we can sell to him. No, but he'll take an ore scanner. What else do I got to sell here? What's this guy selling? He's selling dual fuel packs, 83 of them. Yeah. 
Does that give me enough money to buy the rest of the solar cells? If you're wondering what I'm buying the solar cells for, so basically, if you look in the constructor, let me go out here real quick, because we're done here. Um, if you go to the constructor, the advanced solar panels take solar cells. And we need... I'm going to mark this on the map. Actually, you know what? Let's do... There's a trade station over here. Waypoint, show on HUD. Polaris. SM. SAM. Saying. Show. I'm not even going to try to spell it. I'm just going to call it for Polaris. Trade. Hold on. Cancel. We just trade station. Why did it do it over there? Waypoint, show on HUD. Alright, so there is trade station. Somewhere over here. Right there. I wonder if he sells bridges and guns and whatnot. Oh, this is this one. See if I can get landed here. I think the main building is this one. Go sell some bridges. All right, so we want to sell the matrixes. We want to sell the bridges. All right. Yeah, you guys blast everything and thing in sight. <laughs> this is a pretty OP trade station here, by the way. Excuse me. Thank you. I'm here to buy, buddy. Actually, really, I'm here to sell. Oh, he wants light armor. Night vision goggles. Thought that guy sold bridges. Is it this guy that sells the bridges? Hmm. I mean, we can get rid of some of these containers here. Twenty-five skill points, a thousand galactic, and one hundred rep to the Polaris. Right. And which one of you sells bridges? Quantum Star Technology sounds. All right, so he sells bridges. He sells matrixes. He smells small bridges. And he has an advanced upgrade kit. If we slowly buy um, auto miners, we're doing good. I need some laser pistol upgrade kits, buddy. Do you have them? 
Laser upgrade kits. One. Alright, I guess I'm buying one. Alright. Actually, he's like guns to sell. Hold on. What's he got? The minigun? Did we pick up any miniguns? We have one there. We have one there. Let me sell you these miniguns because I'm not going to use them. That is taking a valuable cargo room. I mean, I can only sell two of them to them, which is fine. He's taking heavy armor. Do I have any heavy armor in the boxes? I have light armor. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything there. This guy over here wanted the light armor, right? Just doing some wheeling and dealing today. <laughs> yeah, he wanted light armor. We'll sell it to him. Alright, pretty lucrative run here. Do we have any more storage crates? Whoops. That needs to go into... Grab this stuff out of here real quick. Put it in the input. Alright, so that's the trade station done. We know Sanctuary's here. Actually, you know what? Let me... Um, delete that. Solar cells. Need to get me close. I don't know what that means. How many solar cells does it take in order to... I'm stuck on something. How many solar cells does it take to make an advanced um, solar panel? Let's look at that real quick. An advanced solar panel. So it takes eight solar cells, some gold, platinum, aluminum, carbon substrate. I mean, that's all doable. It's the solar cells that are um, holding us back. Actually, did they have gold for sale? Hold on, let me go look real quick. I'll go out here. Ah, I need the giblets. Alright. Collect everything here. Gold and aluminum is what we're searching for. Let's go back in here real quick. I'm here to buy. No gold there. Mega Corp. I'm here to buy. He doesn't have any gold. He has aluminum powder. I mean, that's pretty cheap. So, 3509. I'm gonna buy the carbon substrate up. I don't need that. I don't know if we're going to need aluminum powder. But we'll grab it anyways just to be on the safe side. We're looking for a dude that sells gold. Because that might be our bottleneck too. You need to have more upgrade kits in your inventory barrel. Plasma blaster we don't want to sell. Because I might use it eventually. Quantum Star, this is the guy that had the bridges. Hmm. I mean, how much did he want for computers? 
Hold on. We might be able to make a quite a big penny here. Hundred and ten. We can sell about two hundred. There's um sixty seven right there. Computers. Sixty seven. I mean, it's not much money, but he wants flux coils, 62 of them. Flux coils, 62 of them. He wanted power coils, too. We can sell that to him. I'm here to buy. So flux coils, we have 45 of them. And we can sell some of those. Alright, I think that's enough wheeling and dealing. We have cargo packages that we can bring back here later on. Um, let's continue exploring the planet. Well, let's make a daylight for you all. I know it's kind of dark out there, so... Still dark, but I can see a little bit better than normal. Alright, so we're going to go which way? At least we found Sanctuary and we found some... We found some solar shells. We did a little bit of wheeling and dealing. What is this heat signature over here? Fly by it real quick. But look forward to the next episode where we do the assembly yard, everyone. We'll do a little bit more exploring here and then that's where we'll call this video. What is this? It's gotta be a wreckage of some sort. It's just I hate how it doesn't come up until you get like right on top of it. I wish they would fix that. I'm gonna make this scanner better. I know they make a better scanner for the C V and Reforged Eden. Uh it's dark as all heck. <laughs> Sorry everyone. Let me see if I can make a let me see if we can fly towards the sun. There we go, it's getting brighter. Graphite. Promethium. Fuel Depot. Silicon. Yeah, that assembly yard is going to be OP. What I'm hoping is that we can get enough to um, build another auto miner first so we can go put it on some satium. Because I desperately need satium for the um, attack ship. It's either. What do I need for the attack ship? We already have the Plutus built. We want the animal. Now I guess we got the satium. We need the restroom and the cosium. We need some neo. Which we have auto, two auto miners down on. We have copper and silicon that we need. The carbon substrate is going to be our bottleneck. Really. We'll have to go mine out some asteroids and harvest up some trees in one of the episodes. We'll probably do that. We'll go back to the base 
load up the um sorry about the darkness everyone let me see if i can make it well we're almost at the end of the video all right everyone this is where i'm gonna call this video i'm gonna go park next to the assembly yard wherever it went off to let me look here It's that way. Alright everyone, this is where I'm going to call this video everyone. I do hope you have enjoyed this episode. If you did, make sure you storm that like button. And if you're new here, subscribe for more daily videos. Okay everyone, take care and bye bye.